Hey guys, it's James from Outdoor Insight here. I'm here with Ivan from Ivan's UK Tours. And Ivan's gonna to talk to us a little about what he does, but it's kind of guided walking, wild swimming, cycling tours, running tours, a number of things that you can do around the UK. And um, yeah, we're gonna ask you a few questions and let you tell us all about it, Ivan. So thanks for coming by. Yeah, yeah, nice to be here. So, yeah, yeah, I'm super excited. I've been working on computers for 20 years for the NHS and uh, I've finally realised after 20 years, that's not me, I want to be out, out and about. I've yep. got a background in uh, outdoor pursuits. I was in the Cubs and the Scouts and the Adventure Scouts. Unfortunately, not Wild Bear Grills was the chief scout, but uh, so I, I went wild camping from the age of uh, 19 and then it took off from there. I've been uh, at many places around the world. I've been to the Himalayas, uh, which is where I got that from. I yep. walked around Manaslu, got up to 16,000 feet. That was a 12 day trek. I raised three and a half thousand pounds for the Tilganga Eye Center in, uh, in Nepal. Uh, I lived in Mexico for four years and climbed 17,000 feet uh, snow capped volcanoes. You probably didn't know that about Mexico. That's pretty cool. I went uh, backpacking and hitchhiking in uh, Iceland for uh, nine days, all for the big, well, massive saving of the. Uh, I did it for 110 pounds. Okay. I went to Egypt for two weeks, I went to Norway on a motorbike. So, yeah, if anybody wants to do these things, you just gotta you just gotta find a way and go and do it instead of hesitating. Yeah, and so if people want to do some of these uh, things with a bit of guiding, that's what you, where you exactly, can come in. Exactly. Yes, yeah. so I can uh, guide you. Uh, last year there was a friend of mine. She was challenging herself. She was massively overweight. She's lost about ten stones. She was uh, challenging herself to get to one million steps. Well, I said, on your one million step. We'll do that at the top of Mount Snowden. Yeah. So uh, she wasn't at all confident, but you know, we went up there, took her time, plenty of rest, and she got all the way to the top. Yeah, after quite a few hesitations, by coaxed her up to the top, and uh, she was really, really pleased. So, yeah, any hesitations, just think, well, what's the worst? You know, we could sit down, you could go back down. Yeah. Or you don't even have to climb a mountain, you could just go along the flat, and if you don't, if you feel too tired, and I've done this with my family plenty of times. I just say, well, I'll go back and get the minibus. You just sit still. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Yeah. So you can kind of take anyone from sort of less experienced walkers that want to try yeah. and get into more thing up to people yeah. who are doing kind of ultra marathons and want to find interesting running routes, right? Yes, yeah, definitely. And anything is uh, possible. And uh, it says on my business card, always willing to negotiate. So yeah. my website has uh, eight pre-planned tours that I've come up with, dotted around the UK. But uh, if you want to do something different, get in touch and uh, you might want to go to the northern, northernmost tip of uh, the Shetland Islands, for example. Get in touch and we can uh, arrange a tour. Excellent. So nothing's impossible with nothing, Ireland's UK tours? Nothing at all. Excellent. Yeah, we can arrange anything you like. Yeah, come on, you'll love it. Brilliant. Well, thank you very much for chatting to us today. Thanks. appreciate that and uh, we'll put the link in the post. Yeah, great. Brilliant. Thank you. Thanks very much. Cheers.